going to talk a little bit so I don't get a copyright strike because it's a loud noise. So I'm just going to talk and talk. I don't want to get a copyright strike on this video. Hopefully. Okay, was that like Mexican music in English? I didn't even know it's just a thing existed. Mexican music in English? English corridos? I didn't even know that existed. A lot of friends, Spanish people and country people as well. <laughs> so there's a double way we're at there, friends, everybody. Did I just hear Mexican corridos in English? Texas is a unique place, man. I love it out here. The water's not, I mean, it's really windy, so. Lots of sound system, so hopefully, I don't get a copyright strike. Right? This one's pretty loud too, so hopefully the wind noise and me talking will be enough to keep the copyright strikes from coming through. So if I'm just talking and talking and talking and talking and talking and a lot of wind noise, hopefully we'll keep that noise from giving us a copyright strike. Just keep it moving, keep it moving, keep it moving. Hopefully. Not bad at all. Really nice. Country music, some reggaeton, some corridos, some rap, a little bit of everything. Different people, different tastes. Really cool. It was awesome to be here. videos it's a big file hopefully we don't get copyright strikes that's really the little thing we're going to not get the copyright strikes because my music will easily get you a copyright strike hopefully we don't get a copyright strike just talk and talk and talk and talk and talk and talk while the music is blasting so we'll get that there's not too many people blasting music and that's good so beaches you go to it's absolutely Saying how many people blast music, and then you can't really enjoy it because everybody's blasting music. So here it's a few people. It's not too bad. I guess it's if it's a few people in a few places, then you can just drive away if you don't like one spot. Some beaches are so many people blasting music that it just runs it for everybody, and that's kind of the problem. And I guess here they're going with some type of. I'm gonna talk, 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 talk. Make a noise, make a noise, make a noise, make a noise. Copyright strike, dang it. No, 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 noise, 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 noise. Make a noise, make a noise, make a noise. Make a noise. Talking, 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 talking. There we go. Alright, we're far enough from it now. Yeah, I don't wanna catch a copyright strike on that. More fishing out here, and then there's people. So far, none of these beach walk around videos I've ever got more than like 6,000 views. I question why I keep doing them. 
I like doing them, but they just don't get a lot of views. It's something that I enjoy doing for me, you know? Really, they just don't seem to get a lot of views. Like, I've never had one of these. And there's a YouTuber whose entire YouTube channel is just about beach drives. You know, or beach walks, you know? I'm like, well, he's able to pull it off. What's the difference? What this yellow string is the yellow string all over everything I'm at the point where I want to stop doing these beach videos so I don't get enough views. I upload a lot of them. And it's just don't ever get views. It's frustrating. Oh, it is what it is. And I always do them in 4K for some reason. So when I go to download them to use them in a video, we end up with a huge file Huggins up there. Alright okay, guys, so there it is. You pretty much got to see the beach. Check it out.